Zama Zama is an informal settlement based in the west of Pretoria. I am part of an NGO with the name of Schools of Hope. And what we do is we build schools in squatter camps. The Daspur Clinic approach us and said they heard of the work that we've done in Boysens and would we please come and just have a look at the squatter camp. So we came out, that was in August 2013, and we were horrified with what we found here. Nearly a hundred children playing on, on, on the dumping spots, but also so severely malnourished, so dirty and so underfed. So we came out on Thursdays, we've played in a dust for nearly two years and we realized we cannot continue like this. The kids need schooling and they need a proper place where they can, can be taught. Nika Capital has a heart to connect the worlds of what we are very familiar with in uh, the business world with communities that are less fortunate. And one way is to uh, look towards places that's in need of, of good education. The Zama kids are extremely clever. They are very strong with their motor function, but they, they lack um, opportunity. So the school wants to provide opportunity. We saw two um, prominent avenues to get involved with. The first one is, is with a, a teacher development. Um, we felt that there's uh, an ongoing need for teachers to be supported in practical needs of getting to classes and, and being able to do their day's work. So Waste Plan through Niga Capital got involved. We provide them uh, with farms and uh, we train the teachers. So most of them are going to get diplomas within the next uh, two years. And then also with, with the food, so we were able to get um, food suppliers in and to be able to deliver food parcels was what we felt as a direct practical need that we could support with. They opened for us a lot of doors, so they made it possible for us to register our NGO, but the whole package. We felt that an initial way to support would be to provide the legal advice, the structural advice for them to be able to have a platform to raise funds and awareness um, for others to also get involved with and obviously to open up a bank account and have the structural and financial support for them to be able to do this what we see here today. It would have been impossible to, to be on this journey without the necessary partners. Um, once this is uh, sustainable and it works well and the children are being cared for and they support and grow out of their own means, it would be fantastic to also see this in other communities.